Welcome back YouTube, VST here at Peace Tech. This is my Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra and there is a new version of One Hand Operation Plus. The version is 6.121. What are the new things, guys? Add Smart Select feature, rectangle, oval, animation, pin, restricts some functions in multi-user mode. And this is really interesting because as we know, the multi-user mode doesn't really work quite nice in One UI 5. On the Ultra, fix widget disappearing issue in the widget pop-up and fix quick tools to ignore volume slider click action. Other stability improvements. All right, this is quite, quite interesting. We're gonna be testing this. It's brand new from today. As you can just see here, the version 6.1.21.0 is updated from the 16th of January and it is 6.38 megabytes. So without any further ado, I'm gonna click the update button. While I'm updating this application, you might consider subscribing for my channel if you are already not subscribed and 80% of you are not subscribed. So please, if you're watching this video and you particularly like Samsung videos and other tech videos, right now I'm testing Xiaomi turning like crazy. Yeah, you might as well consider to subscribe for my channel. It's gonna be much appreciated. Now let's open one head operation. Let's turn it on. And what is the best way for us to check the new selection options? Well, let's just click on the left handle. Okay, straight right. So, okay, right now, if I do straight right, I'm going to activate my back key. Swipe action, guys. And this here represents the pure power that you can get by using One Hand Operation Plus. Because, guys, okay, let me just show you. I'm now going to turn this straight right swipe to a volume up key. And, okay, see what's going to happen. See? See? Tell me any other phone, any other phone where you can do this just stock. And I can tell you, they are not really a lot. And okay, open quick panel one more time, boom, okay? See, it is really crazy powerful. But we are not here for this. We are here to check the smart select. So we have smart select, which is rectangle, oval, animation, and pin to screen. Let's start with first one. Now it's time for the first test and I'm gonna test the smart select rectangle. I'm gonna go back to my home screen, initiate it, all right? You need to see the trigger here. Oh, okay, wow, I think now I got it. Okay, I'm gonna press down, pin insert. Okay, let me try this one more time. Smart select close, selection discarded. One more time, boom, all right. So let's say I wanna select this, I'm gonna press down and I'm going to now save it. Saving image to my gallery, if I go here, what we can see, exactly this same edit one more time guys so that i'm sure let's this time just do this on a folder so i want to select this done i'm gonna press also the save button okay and going here to my gallery wow okay one more time so let's test this one more time i'm gonna press done and this time i'm gonna put pin insert <laughs> jesus all right i mean it's Samsung, man. How can you not love it? So many options. Wow. You can see I can just go back, minimize it. Oh, this is really good. Minimize it, drag it somewhere. All right. And one more time and close it. Oh, I like where this is going. Okay. Now let's test the smart selection oval. Okay. Back here on my home screen. Do like this. Okay. <laughs> now I press done. Okay. Pretty much clear, guys. I'm going to go to gallery and I'm going to get this oval shape. I think it's clear where this is going. So the next one is gonna be Smart Select Animation. Okay, this is interesting. All right, guys, I am playing one of my videos, so I'm going to initiate again the Smart Selection. And by the way, see here, guys, this is very important. You need to just put it on the screen. You have two options for quality, high quality and standard. Let's go with high. And I'm gonna press record. What happens right now is that my phone is taking 15 seconds of a video. I just think it's like this. So let me just try to save this. I'm gonna go back in my gallery and see the result. Oh, I was right. Okay, so it's indeed a jive or a gif. You can just use this to create jives or gifs and that's really cool. And now this one, smart select pin to screen. Let's see what this is all about. Ah, I understand, okay. So this is pretty much like the first option, but you get the pin directly, okay? So if I go back to uh, the YouTube video, so let's say I'm just playing something and I want to get this pin. I want to get, let's say, this particular frame, boom, pin insert, boom, then I get it. What can I tell you, Samsung is really doing great work, guys. Good luck is taking mobile OS customization to a next level. Prove me wrong. I hope you liked the video, guys. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Please, you and your family, stay safe. VST over and bye.